And this is FloridaWater.com episode. Be showing you all the aftermath that left East Riverside Park Pier pretty much non fishable for a while. It's going to be. Uh, basically, all the wood is gone that. Uh, allowed you to walk onto this pier. I mean, even from here to get to there is not reachable from cement now. Um, so for many of you I didn't know about this place, this is actually a convention center area uh, over there that a lot of people use to host weddings, um, wedding receptions, you know, whatever, prom, all kinds of special events, birthdays, whatever. Um, celebration of life probably as well and after the hurricane that hit it pretty much destroyed a lot of the piers that a lot of fishermen and anglers fished at and so the purpose of this video today is just to show you what it looks like at the time of this video uh, being uploaded so today is November 6th, 2022, and this is currently what it looks like. And I apologize if you can barely hear me because of the wind blowing and all that stuff into the microphone and stuff. But, um, yeah, so this here is looking towards the bridge, towards North Fort Myers area there. Um, and then this used to be over this way, it used to be a floating, a floating dock for boats to park up on and anchor up and go over there to the convention center and over this way here is basically remnants uh debris and stuff that broke off from the crazy amounts of wind force that uh allowed this whole pier to break into parts and throw it into the trees uh that faces i-75 so this is how it looks and then the debris is scattered all the way down here too um and then you know there's also there's the floating dock over that way and this building these two buildings here uh, there's actually video online of water flooding um over that way um during the hurricane i think somebody took a picture from one of these buildings or was actually doing video or something that showed the water surge for um, how much this river pushed in um, to flood uh, the whole area over that way, which would be Palm Beach Boulevard. So there's a lot of debris still that has to be cleaned up. There's a long recovery, um, and it's leaving a lot of people, unfortunately, you know, we're no, with no place to fish. So I just wanted to try to provide you all with uh, information about what it looks like and this is pretty much what the current state of this pier looks like uh tarpon pier is completely level there's nothing left of it there's no wood or anything <laughs> standing in the water so they're gonna have to rebuild that whole thing um and then as i was saying there's just a lot of uh, pieces of the um uh pier from here it's over here all the way down here still in these trees right there you can see and it's way over that way that's how far some of this wood and then we still got more wood over there too all of this stuff over here wasn't really messed with too much but anyway so that's pretty much it i just wanted to do a quick video for y'all show y'all what it looks like and also down there which you might be able to see is more of the pier way down here almost through the parking lot all the way up into them trees over there too so um but that's it if you have any questions for you feel free to leave them in the comments below and i will hopefully be uh, able to do some videos for y'all in the near future until then i'll see you all in the next video then